I have here with me Mr. Brad Mpati. Brad, you're welcome. Thank you. Well, can you please tell us the the main issue or the objective of your association that you just talked about, the Grand Cell? Thanks for such question. And uh, uh, to be short, Grand Cell offers scholarship to needy students, but who are also excellent at the public university uh, of Togo. And by the same means, we offer also technical assistance to them by providing them computers and also uh, devices that they can use to do online courses. By the long run, we also offer advice how to collaborate with administrative issues when they have to go from an office to another when it comes to seek for a job. Okay, so you just talked about providing scholarships. Uh, those scholarships from um, schools in, in uh, the United States of America is the scholarship office that offers this scholarship to the students. How do you come about it? Uh, first of all, let me say this. Uh, I have been uh, awarded a Fulbright scholarship and also uh, folks who have other public affairs scholarships gather in the U.S. to form what we call Grand Cell today. And by all means, all these Togolese collect their own money out of their tuition to pay for the scholarship they are offering to their young folks recognizing what Fulbright has done to folks and to um, all international students who are living in the U.S., we want to give back to our communities what we have been given in the U.S. Well, Mr. Mpati, as we are in studio, we are going to listen to professors and students talk to us about uh, a new approach to teaching in Togolese universities. U.S. for several years now, a new approach to teaching was introduced into Togolese universities. It is the Anglo-Saxon system of education based on the BA master's and doctorate degrees known as, known here as the LMD system. What are challenges and successes of this project program? Let's listen to the head of the English department and some students from his department. the subject are concerned. If you uh, are able to eliminate one of the subjects, you do not take it anymore. And in the past, when someone uh, does not eliminate one of the subjects or two, he has to come back uh, again. And if the person fails, fails two uh, times, the person is expelled from the university. So I think the new system is a good one. Whereby when you are able to make one of the subjects, you will not take it anymore. Yes, I mean, what I know about the, the system is that it requires a lot of determination, a lot of efforts, a lot of means from the students. And I, I know it's not a kind of setback, it's not a kind of situation in which you cannot succeed. If you struggle a lot, you can get there. If you struggle a lot, you can get your BA in three years. I've built with LMD system in three years at English Parkman. It means that it's not that difficult, but Maybe some circumstances that can, you know, can tragic or be some as bad, you know, uh, setbacks in life that can make it difficult according to each student. Uh, some challenges of this program. I think I can say that LMD system is not something difficult, but the the situations such as you know courses. The places where, but I can say that now the teachers and the organization of the university is trying their best to make this system be acceptable. Because first of all, when we came on a campus, the classes were a little bit tight for students to stay in. But today, you can see that due to the amelioration that they've been doing on the campus, we have some. Uh, a little, if I can say, a little sufficient places for students to stay in class and just have the classes as comfortable as possible. Yes, at the beginning it was very difficult. Uh, the
found it very uh, difficult because as you know every new thing is very difficult to cope with but when uh, time went on finally everybody has understood that it's the very good thing uh, it is very demanding let just have to work very hard and uh, especially uh, with this with this uh, new system we need so many teachers and teachers have to work very hard in order to uh, have much information to teach the students and especially at this level we have so many uh, students uh, so far as we talk about uh, semesters and so we have uh, problem of uh, how do you call it classes that is rooms teachers too we need more teachers and more rooms in order to implement uh, this program and uh, uh, the government has also tried to help us a little bit by providing some of the classes so we have been able to multiply the classes and uh, especially in the teach uh, the English department they have recruited some new uh, teachers who are helping us a lot in order to implement this program. I find it uh, very interesting. It, it trains you for tomorrow. It trains you as a future leader and it builds your personality for tomorrow. Well, Brad, you are still in studio. We just listened to students and the head of the English department of the university in the state of Lomé. Talk to us about the challenges and the success of the LMD system, the Bachelor of Arts, the Masters and the Doctorate degree program that is being run uh, on the two university campuses of Togo. What do you have to add to this? Um, to add to this, so we all, all see how students are struggling to cope with the new system. And the grantees that we have under Grand Desel Togo, we have a, a, an approach to share our experience through a platform we have for them. We develop topics that they want to know about. And later on, we offer them how grading system is in the US and Europe. So with this system, they can learn how to turn in assignment and the teacher will grade. And once the teacher grade, they can see their grades online. And also the grade book is also available for students to track on his his or her performance and that way just in case they will have to go abroad to study maybe in you well viewers you are still with us thank you very much for following what we just discussed thank you very much uh, mr brad Batty, for being with us i hope next time you again be with us in studio here certainly yeah thank you so very much well viewers here comes the end of our program today hope to be with you next week at the same time evening have a nice weekend Bienvenue sur le plateau où tout est...